Are you a virgin? Yes. And how old are you? I'm 21. Why haven't you done the deed yet? The key to a strong society is family. And so, in my view, choosing my future husband is like the most important decision I'll ever make. And I'm somebody that I know my heart and I know that I fall really hard when I meet somebody. So I want to uh, retain some level of objectivity when I'm selecting a future partner. And I know that if I had sex with them, I would be completely imprinted on them. And I, instead of being like, okay, is this person, do they have the qualities that I'm looking for in a husband? Or am I just making, like, making it work instead of like seeing red flags and leaving? Is there any reason why you're dressed so modestly instead of revealing like most women tend to do when they come out to Miami? I mean, this is just my personal sense of style. I just think it's respectful to others and to my future partner um, and to myself to just cover myself up more. I know that I, you know, take care of myself. I'm pretty athletic, but I don't need to have that on display. <laughs> you know, when I hear some statement like that, <laughs> that, that makes me feel <laughs> there is hope in this world, in particular in Miami. Uh, all joke aside, do you notice she said, I'm pretty athletic. Like, don't play with me. I'm not like the other women like to display the attribute on the street. But don't worry, underneath is pretty athletic. It's definitely pleasant to hear this kind and to see they still have the good woman. That's really crazy, but I think she's, uh, she's definitely from a religious, religious thing. Uh, so guys, you need to go, go back to the church. But not with the woman of about 30, you know, because they go to the street uh, during all the, their youth. And after they go back to the church, after they have two baby daddy. No, I don't talk about this kind of girl, but all the young girl, really religious. But that means you need to be religious too, right? So her argument is pretty solid, right? She don't want to have sex with someone because she knows uh, it will be pranked. In her and she don't want that she don't try to force a relationship if she see there are too much red flag she don't try to make it there are a lot of people do that especially men because they don't have a lot of option so because you don't have a lot of option you have a, a scarcity mindset so you want to try hard with a woman you know there are a lot of red flag it will not work and after guys don't understand why my relationship doesn't work and why she cheated on me, why she don't respect me. Because man, you know why. Because she's not a good woman. That's it. So go back about her. She know exactly what she want, right? And she will get it because she do exactly what you need to do to get exactly what she want. So she's pretty smart. A lot of women will say, oh yeah, but she don't have uh, experiences. A man prefer to have a woman with a high value and less expensive than a woman have a, a high experiences and a low value. I remember a woman say, yeah, but when you go to, to the, for surgery, you want someone have a lot of experiences. So it's the same for us. No, <laughs> nice try, but no. It doesn't work like that. So I know you want to, I share with you her Instagram. I don't have it. So make a quick move because I see a lot of celebrities, in particular PDD, uh, liked uh, this video. So guys, as you know, we are in a dating market. It's a competition. That's why you need to work in yourself. If you don't work in yourself, the woman you want, another guy want the same woman you want. So the more you go high, like eight, nine, 10, especially a girl like that, you will be in competition with a, with a, a celebrity because everybody wants a, a nice woman. And you know, it's difficult to get a nice woman, a good woman uh, nowadays. So guys, let me know what you think in the comment section and we'll see in the next video. Peace.